Hi, and welcome back to Snowdory Antiques. Yes, I am in the shot. Here we go. Right, now the piece behind me, that piece there, is a, what I would think was a beautiful piece of Welsh history. It's a really, really nice Welsh dresser. Okay, all right, it looks like it's been through the mill a little bit, and it's, um, yeah, it's been battered and hammered. But in all sense of purposes, it is exactly what it was supposed to, well, it is what it's supposed to be. Um, nice early Welsh oak, okay. All right, fair enough, things like that. I mean, that should actually polish out. There will be a bit of problem with that. Um, the odd new knob or handle, bit of a patch here, bit of a colour up there. Poof, piece of cake, shouldn't take too long. Yeah, well, jobs like this, they, uh, they teach you everything that you need to know about construction of pieces. They could, uh, I've, I've, construction techniques that are used in the period when they were made. I mean, this one dates, you're looking at the, the early oak that's involved, um, you're looking at about 1740, 1750-ish. I mean, it, it is, all intents and purposes, a really, really sweet little Welsh dresser. And when it's completed and done, it will be absolutely fantastic. Yes, I do tell myself that every single day, and I do believe that we can do anything. Yeah? And that's what we're going to do with this. Um, first and foremost, the job to do is to break down into component parts and find out what needs uh, replacing, what needs renewing in certain areas. I mean, things like runners and stuff like that goes without saying. Um, you know, there's a lot of wood women. It says there's quite a bit of the timber, uh, like the backboards. They'll be able to stay, but the bottom sections inside will have to go. Um, you know, all intents and purposes, the whole thing's there. The component parts are there, even to the draw fronts. I mean, this is a draw front. As you can see, it's got a chunk out here. And what we'll have to do is let in a piece there and then hide it so you won't be able to see it and colour it and get it spot on, um, which we can do. But you've got one draw, two draws, three draws. It's missing the two centre, but the, the positive side of it is we have the two fronts. The rest of it we can actually build. Okay, Things like this. I never understand how things like this actually happen. Okay, fair enough, it has a hinge on there, and when somebody slams the door, it'll actually whack the hinge off. There you go. I mean, originally, it would have had pin hinges at the top that run up through this section there. Um, so what we'll have to do is put it back to the way that it should be, get rid of these later hinges um, and the, the furniture on it, as in the metalwork, and uh, put in some sympathetic pieces to the actual date of the, the actual dresser. Now, the, like I said, the, the, it, it's a nice... 18th century piece of furniture so it's our job to fix it at the end of the day it's our history and if we can't do it then who the hell can okay right if you want to follow the progress on this more than welcome to i'll carry on putting videos up as i go along of it usually of me crying and rocking in the corner shouting why why um but if you want to follow the progress it'll be on our uh, facebook page twitter page pinterest instagram all that type of gubbins um or you can check out our website which is not only antiques.co.uk see like that brain phase there almost forgot it or you can ask us any questions you want at not only antiques at gmail.com we're here to serve and to help okay in the meantime hope you have a fantastic day it's wednesday yes it's almost the weekend well for some people the rest of us have got to work but you know it, it's one of those times that we look forward to going into work and we crack on with the job mind you haven't said that that's every single day for us okay Right, thanks once again for checking out the video. Look forward to speaking to you soon. Have fun. Bye.